How's it going, guys? We're back with some more Pokemon Legends Arceus. And, uh, I just, and I mean just right now, got my next, uh, or I got enough points for my next star. So let's go ahead and get that. Talk to this girl. Yeah, I finally got enough. Give me my next star. That's right, I've earned enough for star number four. Okay, I'm almost halfway there. With this, you have officially attained the rank of fourth star in the Galaxy Expedition Team. You can now use the Leaden Ball, as Pokemon up to level 50 will also obey your orders. The rewards you earn for survey reports will be greater, blah blah blah. A recipe for Leaden Balls, Apricorn, Black Tumblestone, Iron Chunk. Hyper Potion, okay. Your current rank qualifies uh, you to conduct research in the Coronet Highlands, but you will need help from uh, a particular person to survey and ultimately quell this electrode. Go to the training grounds, you should find them there. Now real quick, I'm gonna keep checking these things until I find the one that I want. Da da da, plain trip zooet's eyes, taste of honey, next. But I don't, nope, not there, I think I have to beat the main game to get it. Hello little Cyndaquil. Uh, yes, door. Hold on, I need to learn some new moves, I think. Let's see, what moves can you teach? False swipe could actually be good. Maybe. What else? Icy wind could be good, potentially. How much damage is that? 60? Eh. Psycho cut, 70... I think I'm actually good on you, Torterra. What about you? Rock Smash, Red, da da da, Energy Ball, Earth Power. What about Monkey? Also, uh, comment down below if you want me to name a Pokemon after you. I will be more than happy to do that. And we're, we're just not gonna, not gonna do that. Hello, Crash. I'm blocking that. There we go. This gentleman is Warden Ingo, uh, who serves Sneasler. You will gu he will guide you into the domain. Please, uh, please to properly meet you. I apologize for that abrupt. How do you do before? I am the Warden Ingo. I understand you'll need a hand from Sneasler in order to meet Electrode. Whether she'll, uh, she'll see fit to help you, however, we can only find out by making the journey. Now let's have a safe journey to Mount Coronet all aboard. Ingo's a bit like you, you know. Like me? He appeared one day from who knows where. What's more much, uh, what's more much of his memory seems to be missing. Oh, so he is, okay, he is from... The other games. Maybe traveling with you will help him, will help fill in some of the gaps of his memory. Okay, because I forget what his name was in the other game, so I guess it is him, since he also kind of appeared from nowhere. In any case, I'm glad you, uh, I'm glad to have help to count on you once again, Crash. Or have your help to count on you, whatever. Good luck up in the Highlands. Yes, let's go to the Highlands. Because I know where that is. Also, look at our team. It is, like, pretty much fully evolved. Also, not sure if I said it already. Probably did. Sorry if I did already. But comment down below if you want me to name a Pokemon after you. 
and I highly recommend you specify or else I will catch a, a cricket on and name it after you. And I will just leave it in my PC or whatever it's called. Coronet Highlands. There you are, my girl. Welcome to the Coronet Highlands. I expect you'll find all sorts of rock type and ground type Pokemon wandering about these craggy, boulder uh, strewn heights. And up there. Right beneath the great rift in space-time is the peak of Mount Coronet itself. This mag magnetism from it may well accept or exert some sort of influence on the Pokemon throughout the area. Uh, fascinating stuff. Okay, let's go. The electrode known as the Lord of the Hollow is somewhat different from the electrode I recall. But its uh, electrical discharges at least are familiar. One false step around it could put you in danger. If you're going to face it, you might consider catching Pokemon that can withstand electricity. It must be difficult being a Pokemon, don't you think? Especially one as irritable as electrode. Then becoming Frenzy 2 boot. So true. It's a tough old life for Pokemon and humans alike. Oh, this person. Well, well, Warden Ingo of the Pearl Clan. Oh, and oh my, the Galaxy Team grunt from before. Uh, you're punching well above your height to seek out the Great Electrode Lord of the Hollow. But by the sheer tenderness of my heart, I'll grant you a trial to see if you're worthy. The greatest obstacle you'll ever face awaits you right here. Battle me if you dare. Oh, did I just say no? Hmm. Well then, let me tell you to to great Melee's take on the whole situation. The frenzy of our nobles is nothing other than a mark of Almighty Sinnoh's favor and protection. Why? Because it makes them stronger. Do I really need to spell out that that's a good thing? We must let my lord frenzy as it may to demonstrate to Almighty Sinnoh that the, di that the Diamond Clan lives as its right, to go right and good. This may even be, dare I say it, the very reason I'm here on this earth. What business is it to the galaxy teams anyway, if Electrode lets loose a few sparks out, out here in the mountains? Really, you should do us all a fav favor and slink back home to the village of yours, rather than persist in this fully... Uh, and with that, bon voyage. Alright, loser. What a selfish outlook. These frenzies cause the Pokemon themselves such suffering. But what is it you want to do, Crash? Press on. Very well. The tracks ahead will be, uh, pure, per, per whatever, but I pride myself on on a uh, safe driving uh to meet sneezler crash you must pass through here wayward cave here you'll find pokemon like golbat and their uh ilk which are quite at home navigating in the dark it's quite dim inside so you'll need to watch your step all right let's go
Well, this is odd. The torches that light the way through the cave are gone. Could this be, um, Mei Li attempting to obstruct us? Either way, there's no need for concern. I know my, uh, my route and I'll conduct us safely. No darkness nor foul weather will delay us. Onward we roll. Take care not to come up. I did not get to read that. I recall faintly that I had a partner once, a precious one. Mm-hmm. Its name escapes me, but I remember that it fi uh, filled flames, whatever. If only it were here, I'm sure it would light us, whatever. I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm probably going to stop reading that because it's going by way too fast. Please forgive the unscheduled stop. I detect an alpha crowbat on our right, to our right. Under normal circumstances, I doubt its presence would obstruct someone so competent as you, but given the poor visibility, I, I propose a track change in the interest of safety. Please follow me. To care not to come uncompany unco to me, whatever. Okay, I'm going to start reading this because it's probably going to keep going by way too fast. This is fine progress. We're nearly home free. Wait, could those be? Let me put those torches back where they belong. This darkness could be, uh, pearly, pearl, pearly, per, whatever, for the next person to pass through here. Perilous, whatever that said. I beg your pardon for the delay. I have lit and returned the torches. My safety concerns have been ad 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 addressed, ready for departure. Sorry, I'm really tired and I cannot read right now. If you follow the track marked by torches, you'll reach the terminus of the cave. Okay, well, can we explore first? Like, what's over here? Gibble. Gibble, gibble, gibble. Yeah, you're coming with me. Thank you. We're gone now. I just wanted that gibble. Oh, wait, no, not that way. God, who should we get rid of? I guess maybe Yanma? Because I, I refuse to get rid of Bidoof and I refuse to evolve Bidoof. Professor Lavington told me how you fell out of this land from the sky. Or fell to this land. For my part, I simply found myself one day here in Hasui, a region whose name I never heard. All I could remember was my own name. I was still standing there in in a uh, befellement when the per, uh, when the Pearl Clan came to my aid. I showed a natural affinity for taming Pokemon, which is why I eventually became a warden. But still, I wonder what my true purpose is here. Uh, but now I've sidetracked us with this talk. Let's hurry onward. What's the big idea of putting back all those torches I spent ages tidying up? Do you get some sort of amusement stomping around and ruining people's noble deeds? 
O, rendering a cave impassable to people who venture inside hardly seems noble to me. Hmm. Well, this just goes to show that even we wardens don't always see eye to eye. I ex uh, extinguish those lights for the sake of the Pokemon in that cave who prefer the dark. But now you louts have put my efforts to waste. If you think I'll just let you uh, sa saunter ahead to meet Lord Electrode, you're sorely mistaken. The only way you're getting past me is if you defeat my partner Pokemon. How will you proceed, Crash? I'll beat him. I thought this was a her. Ghost Skunk Tank, show these louts the true meaning of silent but deadly. Okay, fine, we'll beat her up. I thought that was a guy. My bad. Alright, let's see. Oh, uh, that's, that's not good. Sorry, hit my mic. Let's see. Oh, that, I, I forgot you had flamethrower. Uh, my bad, my bad, Torterra. Aha. Uh -huh. You suck. You suck. You suck. You're bad. Just quit training Pokemon. Listen here. Neither I nor uh, Skunk Tank admi admit defeat just yet. Our challenge to you still stands. However, I will withdraw to, avo to afford uh, Skunk Tank time to recover. There's no shame in a tactical retreat. It's more of an advance, if you think about it. Keep your guard up. We'll be back. Yeah, yeah, just get out of here. What a lively character. Agreed. A real special one. I cannot fathom Warden Mei Li's intentions, but for now, let us press on. God, it's only been 17 minutes? I thought I'd been recording for like 40 minutes now. This is the ancient quarry. The stones used to build the temple atop this mountain were all cut from this place. Whether by humans and Pokemon working as one, or by the labor of Pokemon alone, I cannot say. The stones that were left behind should serve to cover us from the gazes of wild Pokemon. Ah, there you are, Ingo. Oh, it's Volo. Hey, Volo. I like this guy. Volo, what, uh, was it? What, what is the matter, sir? I wanted to ask about the memory loss of yours. Have you considered that it could have somehow been caused by the space-time rift? I have no cause to think the rift is to blame, but then again I hardly remember a thing, so it's difficult to say whether uh, with certainty. I can't remember my own home, nor my family if I had any. So you might do better to pose the, your questions to Crash. I think if it's to do with that rift... Indeed. Well, I do hope your memories returned, Warden Ingo. How about you then, Crash? Do you remember what you saw before you fell out of that rift? Was there anything inside? Maybe so. I mean, we were kind of just like in a void before we ended up here. Interesting. You see, personally, I suspect that whether is on the whatever is on the other side of that rift is causing the strange lightning that plagues us. I mean, makes sense. Like, they've, they've been saying that, like, it came from the rift, like, all the wardens. 
Indeed, I did some digging and found records indicating that the, this space-time rift also appeared in Hasui in the distant past. That's what we already heard. A that's why we already had a name for it, as it appeared in fact. Now, what kind of world do you suppose stretches out on the other side of the rift? My guess is that the, uh, it is all my Sinnoh's realm. But then that begs the question, why has the space-time rift reopened when it closed once long ago, so long ago? And why would Crash have fallen through to us? There's just uh, so much we don't know. I uh, fervently, whatever, hope you unravel this mystery, Volo. I'm sure it would ex ease people f people's fears to over the frenzies of our nobles. And while you investigate, sir, I'll continue to prioritize the safety of the people living in this world. Oh, I am a mere admirer of ruins and little more. If something needs investigating, then I would entrust that task to Crash. Until next time, then. I like that guy. He's pretty cool. Pretty chill. Once we're through here, it'll be just a little further. Let us move with speed, but not to, but not haste. Oh, I thought he said this face would protect us from wild Pokemon, and yet there's wild Pokemon here. Sir, you have lied to me. I now do not trust you. This giant bell keeps following me, and I don't feel safe. Hello. Oh, we looking up. You would never expect to be able to climb such sheer cliffs as, the, as these, yes? But with Sneasler as an ally, it becomes the work of a moment. She is so at home on a cliff face, one might think she knew some secret, some hidden move. Oh, like rock climb? What am I saying? Hidden moves? There are no such things in Hisui, surely. Yet, I feel as though I was on the cusp of remembering something just now. Just who was I before I came to Hisui? If you fell from the sky, you come from another world altogether, most likely. Perhaps a Pokemon battle with you would jog this memory loss. Sure. Would you honor me in a battle, Crash? Why not? All aboard. Whatever else you said. You like to make a bunch of train references. Ooh, throwing it behind the back. I saw that. And that should kill. Ooh, Gliscor. By the way, Gliscor, like, top three favorite Pokemon. I need to get a Gliscor on my team now, now that I know he's in the game. I need one. There goes your Gliscor. 
Tangela. Uh oh. Oh no. Yeah, that was like four times super effective, I'm pretty sure. Oh no. Uh, Badoof, do something, please. Almighty Badoof, I believe in you. Go, bite him. Bite him. Let me lower game audio, sorry. Might lower that a bit more. Bite again. You got this. Just do one more. Oh no, strong style. That's not good. Oh no. No! Badoof! Oh, you're gonna pay for that. You are gonna pay for that, Torterra. You know, we started fighting you with Bite, and we're gonna end this with Bite. That's what I'm talking about. Your talent has brought you to the destination called Victory. Now allow me to call Sneasler. Oh, I... I don't like that. Oh... Please, please put that thing away. Allow me to introduce you, Crash. This keen clawed Pokemon is Sneasler. Would you be so kind to play your flute for her to hear? No. No, please, no. Put that thing away. End that thing. It should not exist. That thing is an abomination. Please put it away. No, don't act like you- No, we're not friends here. Don't act like we're friends. I don't want this. I don't want to talk- No, take it back. I'm afraid this is my final stop. Please proceed up the cliffs with Sneasler's aid and quill the lord up in the mountains. No, don't leave me with this thing. I will return to Jubilee Village. Please convey my well wishes to Warden Maylee. Now then, all aboard. No, don't leave me here alone with this thing. Call S No, I don't want to call Sneasler. I don't want to be near this thing at all. But I have to. Yeah, I'm just kind of stuck here without it. Okay. Sneasler, after I'm done with you, I'm never using you again. Like, if I have to, I, if I have to go up a mountain, I will find a way around it. I refuse to use you after this. Stop going up the tree, you idiot. <gasps> Gligar. 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 I need it. Give me. I want Gliscor. I'm gonna have a Gibble and a Gligar on my team. Hey, stop flying around. Stay. Thank you. Ooh, and you're level 40, so you're on par with the team. Love it. Alpha Gliscor down there. Alpha Gabite. And we're gonna run. Yep, I expected that. Keep going. Oh, the statue of Dialga. Oh, that's cool. 
Oh, and Palky, okay. There's a nose pass, another Gligar. God, why do I have to use this thing so much? Oh, that, there's Voltorb. Wait, is there a new form of a vi Is there like a new Voltorb? Because Ingo said that the Voltorb looks different or Electra looks different. Oh yeah, he, he looks a little different. I can confirm. He does look a little different. All right, well, we're like right where we need to be. So I think I'm going to end the video here. So thanks for watching. If you do want to see some more Pokemon Legends Arceus, then make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. Also, make sure to check out my Discord and my TikTok. There's a link to both of those in the description down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.